that around a little bit. Hi, <laughs> Giovanna Bello is our guest. We're going to trace that camera, okay? And they, yeah, this is it's all about the logistics. Can you hear me okay? Yes. Okay. Please don't ask difficult questions. Yeah, no difficult questions. I have to say, uh, it seems like the, the libero sometimes doesn't get a lot of uh, publicity. You have done a heck of a job there. What's it like to that position and have all those come at you so hard? Thank you so much. Um, I really like playing libero. I love passing and digging the ball, so I don't know. Like, we don't get attention, but I love to do it. Well, people that like the game know that it starts with a good first dig or a service pass. How did you get so good at this? I don't know. I think it's my dad always says 50, 50 percent, uh, technique, 50 percent, um, right? Like how you're thinking about it. You know, that's a very good point because I think you have to be very tough mentally to play that position because you're not going to handle every ball. Yeah. It's hard because, like, you're there just to do this. Like, you're just doing like, one or two things. Right. So, like, like when you don't do it, it's like, like frustrating because you're there just to do that thing. You don't have like, multiple areas where you can act and, like, compensate one play that you didn't do, like, good. Yeah, Giovanni Bello is our guest here in the postscape. Uh, you're sleeping tonight. So you've got another match tomorrow. What's it like to come back and play again in that short of time frame? I think it's good. Um, we have it every day, so like we're kind of into it. Yeah, big weekend for you guys. Mm -hmm. It starts out well tonight. I, I wanted to ask you about the libero position also. You were in there for the, you know, for the entire match. You don't need to take three rotations off like some front row pro people do. Uh, you have to be in great physical condition to be in this position. You have to be yes. Um, it's hard to stay all the time in, but at the same time, we don't. So it's something that we don't, like, we don't get as tired as people that jump. So we can handle, like, more time in the court, I think. We were talking about how narrow back row players don't get a lot of attention. I'd say we'll pay attention to your teammates. I sure appreciate <laughs> every ball you get out. Yeah. And your coaches love that as well. So, yes. I, so a heck of a job. Would you uh, take a little bit of time to tell us about your family a little bit? Um, yeah, my dad is a volleyball coach. He is. That's why I like volleyball most of. Um, and, yeah, and they are in Brazil. My mom, my dad, my brother. I have a little brother. And then, yeah, I love them. So your dad was your coach. Yes. You played for him, uh, obviously, for yeah. a while. Yeah, beach volleyball, yes. Was he on you? Yes. Most coaches <laughs> would be harder on their own kids than they would be. Yeah, he was really hard on me, and, like, we used to fight a lot. So. Really? won those fights. <laughs> he did. Oh, well, sh what did I tell him? Do they speak English? Can they understand if they're watching? Um, I think my dad understands a little bit, okay. but they don't speak English. My brother understands and speaks. Do you, uh, you, you speak, uh, uh, just say that, uh, the language you speak? Portuguese. Uh, Portuguese. Thank you. I knew it. I couldn't <laughs> say it. Would you like to say something to them in Portuguese? My pai, eu vou te pago. Eu vou. Beijo pra todo mundo. That was good. <laughs> Thank you know, you. if she said, I'm a really good little girl and have a great time, that's what I think you probably <laughs> have in your heart. So uh, thank you for coming. Thank you for inviting me. Well, it's been my pleasure.